Welcome back everybody. This is the Kilauea eruption update of 23 April 2021. Just to let you know, I do the Kilauea Volcano Hawaii eruption updates about twice a month. Unless something spectacular happens, then I'll update it more frequently. I keep these eruption updates simple and straight to the point. So let's get started. Okay, as of this date, the eruption of Kilauea Volcano still continues. The only active vent is actually located on the west part of the lava lake. This eruption has continued non-stop since December 20th, 2020. The depth of the lava lake has increased. Right now, it is 741 feet deep as of 23 April 2021, which was a 13-foot increase since 3 April 2021. Sulfur dioxide emissions are at 950 tons per day and is still less than the pre-2018 eruption levels of 5,000 tons a day. Okay, here's the tilt meter readings for the past month of April and part of March. Those ridges you see there means inflation. The volcano is inflating as magma moves into the magma chamber, similar to a balloon inflating. Those dips means the volcano is deflating. It's very similar to a balloon deflating. It is normal for Kilauea Volcano to have these inflation and deflation events. Here's a thermal map of the Kilauea caldera. That blue area that you see there is the original lava lake that covered that entire area. The blue area is solidified lava. The yellow area that you see there is the active portion of the lava lake. It is about 320 meters long by about 200 meters wide. Still pretty huge. Enough for two soccer fields to fit inside. Here is the most recent earthquake map. There were a few minor earthquakes at the summit and the upper east rift zone here, noted by the circle. Seismicity is stable and tremors elevated at the summit. The middle and lower east rift zone is stable and quiet. Here is the air quality sulfur dioxide concentration map. The majority of the time, the gases blow from the summit towards the southwest and up the west coast of the Big Island of Hawaii. Green means safe levels of sulfur dioxide in the air, and dark red means hazardous levels of sulfur dioxide in the air. Up next is a thermal and full day time lapse of Kilauea Summit Lava Lake from 4 April to 22 April 2021. 